Guys, and welcome back to the world of post Finem. We are in a post apocalyptic, obsidian lined, horrendous world where everything and anything is out to kill us. And as you would have just seen on my. Eh, alright time lapse I just did. I had a few camera problems. We ended up glitching through the wall a few times, stuff like that. I have started my downward expansion. Now, I quite like what I've done with it. It is simple, it is elegant. Uh, I need something to put on there but I quite like this room here I need a, I need a ceiling and I need a, a floor but I like this design for what we've got it's it's nice it's bright there's nothing gonna spawn down here and down here further down here rather I've started moving my crops because they were up top here oh, let me let me press my sprint button they used to be up here and uh, that was all right I suppose but it was all crowded up here I felt a little bit squished in I I, I didn't really like what was going on here so I went through many picks on the way down here. Many, many picks. Uh, I'm not sure if I told you last time that I've selected on what my favourite pick is. If we just come in here and have a look on the pick, uh, you'll see we have many, many types. Now, what I've been paying attention to is the durability. Not so much the attack damage, because we attack with other things. And the one that I like the best, I believe, is this one, the 850 um, the mechanism one. Now this is quite expensive, and I think if we work it out for iron and carbon put in, uh, as opposed to the resources here and the sticks, I think it actually works out that we spend the same amount of iron for the same amount of durability. But I like this one because I like to use as little, uh, I like to come up and change my pick as little as I possibly can. So we're just going to build another one because I literally just smashed up my last one, so we need, we need to come down here and do some extra stuff. I'm just going to talk you through what we're doing here so this is just an empty space it is going to be for my farm I, i'm feeling like four different farm spaces mainly for this oh, oh 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 i've glitched my way into the floor somehow mainly for this space here now this is not going to stay like this what we're going to do is knock these through and then put down some crops here and if we if we do this right do that now these two should mutate together and make something here now the reason i want to do that if we look in here is eyes that don't cry potatoes uh, one source of potassium is from gunpowder you can get that from exploding mutants and often no this is not potatoes are good force uh, good food source and they require some potassium to synthesize i'm not going to synthesize i'm not going to synthesize and i was fairly sure the book told me not to synthesize let's just i may have been on i may be on the wrong bit maybe we want sugar cane not not potatoes uh let's go to potato uh crop produce uh potato seeds that's that's not what we want uh synthesis yeah that's very good oh can we not no all right looks like i got mixed up between that and sugar cane sugar cane here we go because we can we can make this somewhere no is it sugar seed rather than sugar cane sugar seed there we so between wheat and carrot on some sand Ooh. okay so we need to swap these things out this is just gonna make what is that this is just seeds yeah seed seed so we've made a, a different type of wheat here not not what i actually intended to do let's um put this here do i have a carrot seed this is a question. I do not have a carrot seed. That is why I did this the way I have so far. So let's just pop this off. Um, you will notice around I have doorways and stuff like this. This is uh, future planning. Uh, we need a, a crop analysis room. That is, that is definitely something we need. Somewhere to... Ah, no floating blocks in this game. Okay, let's get that back. What happened to all my torches that it just popped off? It literally just popped all my torches and didn't give them back to me. Oh, that's, that's terrible. Okay, so I'm going to pop some andesite there. No, we can't even put it on the roof. Can't have it a free-hanging roof structure. Can that go? Okay. All right, so let's take this back. Oh, this is going to be horrible. Can we put this here? It's cobblestone. I wish there was like some sort of strength system. that, that It could tell me 
uh, what blocks would hold on and what blocks wouldn't. Much like if you guys have played it, Seven Days to Die. I wish I wish there was something like that where it tells you the hardness of the block and what it's going to do and stuff like that. Okay, so we need to replace this with sand. We also need to replace each of these with dirt, which I might be able to do right now. I do have an awful lot of dirt on me. It's one of the things I made to make sure we could do things like this. Uh, so, the reason I've got this bit of water here, uh, if you couldn't have guessed, is to keep all my crops hydrated. Uh, I'm not going to go ahead and plant these crops here because we need new crops. What I'm going to do is new crops in each uh, quadrant. Are these quadrants? Yeah, they, they appear to be quarters. So we're going to do a new crop in each quadrant. Uh, now, this is all so I can get going with this this um, but life rebooted quest line because uh, I have been kind of jumping around a bit and doing just whatever I felt necessary at the time but I think once we get this sorted we can then go off and do lots of other things I mean I know I am mainly surviving on triglycerides but we'll we'll, we'll make do with that something will happen uh, this place needs some serious designing it, it definitely needs uh, a nice little touch and I need to do things like this and fix these uh, the other thing I need to do uh, aside from deal with these hollow spaces that we found here, this was mainly full of gravel and, and stuff like that, is if we come all the way up here, oh look it's daytime, good, I've got chests full of stuff, and I mean literally full of stuff, I, I really need to make a storage room, now I don't know if chests are going to be my best uh, option here, I've not really had a look round and seen what the different storage options are so I just thought I'd uh, come out and have a look around during the day to see what's going on out here one thing that I really want to do one one other thing that I want to do today is try and get some sort of passive mob system up so we've just discovered that this does indeed actually work it only works against uh, mobs though not players that's why I was running around running up against it going oh no I'm not I'm not taking any damage what's going on here well, it's because I'm not a mob. Uh, another thing I want to do, and I think we're going to do it now. You saw me fighting Silverfish in the uh, time lapse. If you didn't go back, it, it, it was quite quick. It's whilst the camera was coming down the, the stairs that I just happened to fight them all. But we've got more up here. So I think I'm going to take them on. I, I think I'm going to take them on. I'm, I'm well fed. I'm going to do this. I've got... Hang on. I'm just going to rearrange my bar so we can do stuff. I've got a gun. Which is nice, but more importantly, I've got a sword. Uh, the sword so far has been a much better piece of equipment for fighting stuff. Uh, so we're going to go with that. Oh, look at that. Brilliant. Uh, so yeah, we're just going to go with the sword for now. Uh, maybe we'll use the, the gun. Maybe we'll use the gun. Let's... Yeah, it's, the, it's this reload time. But thankfully, that tells them... Oops, I was too busy watching those guys over there. It tells them all to start running around and get out of there. So, uh, did, those, did one of them just disappear into a block around there? That would be very bad. Uh, like, very, very bad. I definitely want to be able to get them all out. Like, if he, if he suddenly went in there, no. What about this? No. Okay, let's just take these out and see what happens. Uh, oh, no, that's a... Oh, no, these are just normal cobble. Okay, that's good. All right, so there we go. We've cleared up here. I'm going to go rip down these trees and get some more wood and stuff because, you know, that's one of the things I need. I left my axe downstairs in my toolbox. Uh, I will be back with word about what we're going to do for, well, for the growing of crops. In fact, let's, let's have a look in here. Do we have any sand in here yet? No, I do have a lot of gravel. If there is one thing that I made a lot of during my time, it's gravel. Oh, look, we've got rotten flesh happening here as well. Not rotten flesh, rotten food. I'm going to just take this out, pop it in here. No, no one wants the rotten food. Uh, what do we have over here? We also have some food here, but more importantly, we have my tools, and I don't have an axe. Why do I not have an axe? All right, I will see you when I'm going to go cut down trees, and I'll be back. Hello, little buddy. What are you doing up there? You ain't no problem for anyone. Do you reckon I can shoot him, actually? Boom! Yeah. Anyway, that's one tree down. Yeah! Okay, so we got a lot of stuff. I also went and did some stuff with that wood. Uh, did I do it in my inventory? No, I didn't do it in my inventory. I went and put it back in a chest. So I went and brought all the wood and popped it in here in the form of half a stack of chests, which I thought would be brilliant. Okay, uh, something else I wanted to show you uh, with this pickaxe that I thought was lovely. You'll see my, my ceiling looks nice and flat now. So if we come over to here and just start wailing away on this obsidian block. Now, aside from the fact that it takes forever, you'll notice that I've actually picked up the obsidian. I mean, how, how good is that? So if that's not a plus for this steel, uh, steel pickaxe, I don't know what is. <clears throat> okay, so... 
there are a couple of quests that we've got that need uh, a lot of glass. Like, this one needs a lot of glass. Obviously, the um, sugarcane needs glass. And all we've got is... Ooh, let's have a look. One, two, and a bit stacks of gravel. So I'm going to take these two and a bit stacks of gravel and run them through our chemical decomposer. We should be able to do this. This will this will take a while. In fact, how much power do we have? Oh, that's it. We're out of power. We're out of power. Okay. Well, there we go. We're, we're going to take some of these. I will figure out what to do with those when I'm not in the middle of talking. We've only got one silicon dioxide here. Okay. So... Maybe we won't do the thing that I was going to do. Uh, maybe we won't do both of these quests. But the one quest we are going to do is definitely the one with the sugar cane. We could grind, we could crush, we could pulverize, we could do all that. Or we could put eight in the chemical synthesis machine like that. It wasn't eight, that was 16. Uh, let's break these down into fours. Well, those fives are pretty good. Two, three, four. Okay, and that should be almost all of this brilliant well i actually wanted three bits of sand but we're going to go down and show you what i was going to do with this because well that's what i wanted to do now i've not actually placed any crops on this before so i don't know if we need to no we don't okay cool i was wondering whether we're going to need to hoe it or anything like that but no we do not okay that is brilliant that's actually everything i wanted to cover in this segment well aside from the fact that we've got no power here but the thing i want to know so i've got where is it a Lead, uh, lead stone uh, flux capacitor. Now, uh, this is out of power, so let's break this down. Can we put this back in between the two and then power it up with the flux capacitor? That would be useful. No, there appears to be no input for the flux capacitor. That's uh, that's not great. Use while sneaking to activate. Activate to charge held items must remain in hot bar. No, that's not what I want. So this means that it's for things like my jetpacks and stuff like that. So we have a bit of an issue. How do we create power? Um, oh, oh no, 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 turn off. Can we do that here? No. No, that's that's not something we can do. I just wanted to see if there was anything we could do there. Okay, so let's put this back. We need to make some sort of generator then, right? That, that's what I'm getting here. Is, this, is there a quest in here to do with that? I do not know. I'm actually... Oh, we've got some basic quest... Ah! Aha! Look, there is a whole thing here that I had not seen before. We're going to have to go through all of this. High-tech storage. Drawers are great and can store a lot of stuff, but for those who want to st store even more, a cache is what you're looking for. That's why I couldn't find it. It's a, it's a C, not an S. Uh, a task where a player has to craft. Okay, so let's let's get on with that. Or at least let's have a look at what we need for this, shall we? Uh, I was supposed to be prepared for this, but you know me, guys. I'm, I'm, not, a, I'm not a very... Uh, prepared person that's a creative one there's the cash so we need a log okay we can do a log and we need tin is it just tin now thankfully we've been collecting up a lot of tin uh so how much have we got here we can get a, get a, a stack of tin that's fine let's clear this out of the way now i'm presuming it's 15 uh 16 9 10 11 12 13 14 so it's not 15 it's got to be 16 so we want four of these that's an entire stack. Wow. What well, do you know? Of course, of course it is. You know, do the maths. Um, but we're going to put that there. Do this here. Mess it up a little bit, but that's okay. And there we go. We've got a quest. Oh, shambolic as always, but we got it done. Uh, so the reward is we get some uh, AB9 clips. That's that's cool. Uh, and what do we want in... Re Ooh, ooh, oh, wow, this is actually quite hard to, like, do we want the hardened glass? I can see the hardened glass being useful. I can see the invar being useful. But I think all these things we can make. Maybe get the invar. We're going to get some invar anyway. All right, let's do that. I'm sure you're all going to tell me how ridiculous I've been by doing that. But there we go. By mixing copper with iron three oxide, you can create the compound known as redstone dust. The dust has good condu conductive properties and is the basis of most technologies. So we've got to make some redstone dust. Okay, so um, copper and iron three oxide. Copper and iron three oxide. Let's have a look and see what's going on over here. I probably don't have much iron three oxide um, or any, any iron oxides at all, actually, because I've been doing this very silly thing of breaking them down. All right, this is going to take a little bit more planning than I thought it was. I will be back in a second with something that's not quite as shambolic as what we've just done. Okay, so it turns out iron three oxide a lot easier to make than I thought it was going to be. So we, we've made a few of these. The next one, of course, is redstone. Where, where is it up here? So to make this, we come across, where is it? The synthesis machine. Copper in the middle, iron three oxide up top there. Uh, we've got a stack of copper here. We've actually been collecting quite a bit of copper. 
I think we only need the one redstone. Is it? Is it just the one redstone? Uh, let's get back in here and have a look. Uh, four. Four redstone that we need. Okay, one, two, three, and one for luck. Even though it was one to finish. Okay, there's our 100% redstone. Oh, oh. Do we want a repeater? Comparator? Some torches? Now, the comparator is probably going to be the hardest thing to get hold of now that I'm thinking about it. Because sticks and redstone, it's redstone and st torch. Stone, redstone, redstone torch is a repeater. But the uh, nether quartz, that's going to be a bit awkward. So I'm going to do that, hopefully. Did I have space in my inventory for that sort of stuff? There, there's the comparator. Okay, cool. Let's uh, drop a few redstone-y things off here. Obviously, the redstone's going to go in with my... Um, farming and tools i mean why would it not let's just put a few of these away uh the and oh 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 the the rake is actually something i want to keep an eye on no uh so i came down here a second ago i oh there's weeds here why why are there weeds everywhere oh god this this wasn't what this this wasn't oh no my my all my wheat all my wheat. What are we supposed to do about all my wheat? What is going on here? This is not what I wanted at all. Ah, that's actually um, more than a little bit unfortunate. These ones are, are quite good. We're going to put them there. Uh, and we're going to go around and fill in more seeds. Ah, I didn't realise that had happened. Quick, let's let's go grab some more stuff and we'll come back down and we'll make sure some no weeds have happened. Because we have a load more wheat here, uh, I don't know how much I'm actually going to need, but we'll, we'll, we'll sort it out. Uh, let's have a look. We need six, seven bits of wheat. Okay, we can we can do that. I can't split this down like I want to. Uh, there we go. Seven bits of wheat. Bam. A little bit worried about that. A little bit worried about that. But this is the way things go. We've got some weeds growing here already. I've got a feeling that's probably something to do with the way I've been doing things. Probably. Probably. Um, let's just leave this for a moment. The thing is, I don't want the weeds to take over. I think that's probably what happened here. It's like, so some some weeds had grown here when I was upstairs mucking around. I came down, I cleared all the weeds out, but obviously somehow it had crossed over to this lot. This is what I'm guessing anyway. Yeah, maybe. Uh, this isn't doing anything that I want it to do, so let's go back to the quest book. What have we got? Power for the people. This is exactly what we want. We want the sterling generator. Sterling. Uh, let's just come in here and go Gen. Uh, e. Ray. There we go. Takes a while to, to get stuff. Wow. Okay. So we need stone bricks. Is it all just uh, forms of stone bricks? A furnace. Basic gear. Oh, you know what? I think we can. I think we can make this. Can make this. The the piston's going to be a bit awkward. The piston is going to be a bit awkward. Uh, I could definitely do with emptying my inventory if we're going to do stuff like that. There is something else that I wanted to do as well, but we will do that in a moment. Let's put these back. It is to do with the razor wire, and I will nail that in a second. Uh, so, what do we need for? Let's start with the piston. First thing we need for a piston is. So, oh, let's, let's put this invar somewhere. Where can we where can we put the invar? Do you reckon the invar can live in this? Yeah, look at that. All right, brilliant. Uh, we need a an iron block, uh, an iron ingot. Uh, do we have enough here? We do not have enough here, and I think we're starting to run out. We are at thirty one, so I'm just gonna take a load um, and go from there. Like this is sixteen, brilliant, awesome. We'll take this. Um, right, piston. We know how to make the rest of a piston. There should be a bit of redstone down here. We should have four bits of cobble. One, two, three, four. And three planks. Now, this is the thing we might ha not have to hand. No, we don't have any planks. So we, could, we can quickly knock this up, though. This is not beyond the realms of possibility for us. So it's always the iron in the middle, uh, redstone at the bottom, because that's where the signal goes in. That's the way I always remember it anyway. Uh, and then juggle wood across top. Piston. Boom! Yeah. Okay, so what ne what's next? These basic gears. Four cobble, four sticks. We need two of those. I've only got six sticks, so that's not very useful. Let's... Uh, whack these out here. I've got a load of gravel on me. I don't want the gravel. What I want is the cobble. Um, I need a few bits. I only need a few bits. Uh, so we go there, 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 and there. Correct, is it? I don't know. The sticks might have been in the middle. No, there we go. I only want two of those. I only want two of those. Uh, maybe needed more. Maybe needed more, but I don't know. Uh, sticks all around the outside. Can we shift click? We cannot. I need some brick. Need some brick. Uh, stone bricks, just like that. Just like that. And then hopefully we can shift click now. No? Alright, fine. We'll go up and around like that. We've got the... Was it the, the 
Ah, it's the furnace I'm missing, which once again, I've gone and put all the cobble away. I don't know why I didn't think I needed a, a furnace there. Can we split these down into 8, 12, 10? No, no, we can't. Oh, let's just put all these away. Trying to be clever, and it backfired on me. Trying to be clever, and it backfired. This happens quite often to me. This happens quite often. Okay, maybe now we can do this. Oh, there we go. We got a power source. Yeah! I think for now we're going to have to throw this on top of here. Uh, like so. Uh, and hopefully we can pick it up with a crescent hammer or a pickaxe or something like that. Now we're looking for things to burn. There's some burning. Uh, always active. Configuration IO. I want to look at the bottom. Is that uh, an out? How do we make that a pull? A push. There we go. Push. Push is to go out, surely. Okay. Uh, and then this puts power over here. I just want to see that there's power over here. All right. Brilliant. That is exactly what we wanted to do. What did we leave in here? Must have been some limestone for calcium carbonate. Woo. All right. Well, that was a, a bit of a runaway adventure there. But we've got power. Finally. Yeah. I, I think that's quite a, uh, a high high priority thing here we've got no crops growing around here i was expecting crops to be here weeds weeds are everywhere what's go what's going on here oh my quick quick get on, get on top of it get on top of it i'm not impressed not impressed this keeps happening um let's whew, let's uh, turn some of these into some carrots and hopefully hopefully we should be able to do things like let's make that let's make some super carrots yeah, can we make super carrots? Is that a thing that we can do? I, I hope that's a thing we could do. Now, this is blatantly going to be running in the background while I go around and do lots of other things. So, yeah, let's uh, let's wrap this up and see what else we have to do. Well, time has definitely run away with me today, but we have got the first thing that I set out to do finally done. We've got ourselves a bit of sugar cane here. Another thing that I'm going to do is we're going to turn this into... Oh, no. How do we turn this into a seed? It wanted a seed here, did it not? And let's have a look in here. Yeah, sugar cane seeds. Uh, I don't think I can do that. How do we? How do we turn this into seed? Let's let's find out. This is this is one of the next steps. Oh, put a G in there. That would help. Next steps on to doing this. Yeah, there's there's that. Do I actually have to full on break it? Do I have to full on break it? Let's do it. Oh, I didn't like that. I didn't like that. And that didn't give me what I, that didn't give me what I wanted anyway. Oh, uh, well, I don't know how we're going to do this. I really don't know how we're going to do this. Uh, let's put that in there. No, over here. No. Okay. So, well, we will say, hey, look, I did the sugar. The other thing that I want to show you that I have done is up here, all the way up here. Thankfully, it's nighttime, so I can show you. It's already been effective. Uh, I have made a little defensive pod here. This is just somewhere where I can try and get, like any mobs attention over there and because this is a uh wow well, an offensive a defensive it, it makes a lot of makes uh, damage for the mobs i can see a spider over there but it won't come but anyway a, sp a skeleton had run up here and got stuck down in that hole and killed himself on there i did a few jump jump hits and and that did all right I, I have since put this up here and i don't think i like it i don't think i like it but there we go there's some way that i'm starting to turn over some mobs uh let's just run through what we've done throughout the whole of today like the first thing obviously i have moved all the farming stuff downstairs made this lovely little hallway here let's just make sure there's no weeds growing there or not uh we have done all the farming we have got some power sorted and in fact on the power front if we come back a little bit i have got an uncompleted quest here so we're going to claim uh we're gonna claim the gold i think yeah let's do that all right guys and with that i'm gonna say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure i will see you next time we're gonna go carry on pushing on get some more crops done try and figure out how to move all that stuff i hear the cardboard box is the way to go and i need the sawmill for that we're gonna push these walls back and we're gonna put this uh seed analyzer in here and then we're gonna figure out what went wrong with the sugar cane and why why i can't turn it to seed i, I don't know i'm not an egg i'm not an agricraft expert so i'm gonna have to go and look at the wiki but anyway i will see you then oh when we're gonna do that <laughs>